What is up guys, it is Zombie King 706 here, and welcome back everyone to a brand new video. And in today's video, we are going to be making a castle. Now you guys may uh, recognize this world that I'm currently in. This is the ultimate XP farm world that we're playing in right now. If you guys have not seen this world, I definitely suggest you guys check, uh, go check it out. Um, so far there's part 1, where there's the tour, and then there's part 1, and then part 2. Um... This is not going to be part of that. This is going to be a tutorial on how to build a medieval castle. Now, I've built one of these before. I never recorded or anything. Made it a long time ago. And I decided, you know, why not to make it again. Um, this one's going to be a little bit different than the last one I made. Um, I have, like, like I, ha I thought about it last night. Um, I have a piece of paper right here beside me with, like, you know, how many blocks I need, the materials I need, and all that good stuff. So we're going to be looking at this. And uh, we're going to be make this is our main house right here, but we're going to be building a castle and I'm going to be building it right over here. Now, this is something you could do in survival. I just want to show you guys this. This is the quarry that we built in episode one and two. This is what we did. And uh, we filled up this entire chest right here with coal. This one's empty. This one's full of all, you know, all the other random stuff. And then from here to there is filled with nothing but stone not cobblestone stone because we used um silk touch pickaxes so all of this is filled with stone so i mean if you did this is a 25 by 25 area we mined all the way down and put a, um, a staircase down and if you did something like this you could definitely easily 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 have enough to do this now we're going to be using um stone oh, this is silverfish huh <laughs> I didn't even realize this was silverfish. I'm glad we did not start building. There we go. Um, so we're going to be building this. The first couple blocks that you're going to need are stone bricks, um, cobblestone slabs. I don't think we don't even need these slabs. So something I'm actually going to do is we are going to make a trash can over here real quick. Boom. This is going to be our trash can where we can throw stuff and we don't need. Um, so we're going to definitely need cobblestone stairs, cobblestone slabs as well, and some stones so I can fix it up. And we have a potion of swiftness as well, which we're going to be putting on. So you're going to need a pretty decent sized area, not that big. I don't, it doesn't necessarily have to be this big, but definitely somewhere that's pretty big. It, probably at least a 30 by 30 area maximum, or minimum, I would say, not maximum, minimum. All right, here we go. So we're going to start off with um it doesn't matter which way you put it right now because you can make the the front door wherever you want i'm probably going to make it facing actually i hadn't even thought about this probably facing that way i guess yeah facing that way but anyway so here you go we'll start in this corner so you want to go one two three one two oop my bad one two three one two three one two three you should have something like this just like that using our stone bricks super uh, simple kind of like making an in portal just like this now coming on the farthest block right here to the on the right side you want to come out 13 blocks not counting this one so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 and then put a 14th and then do this same symbol again or same design okay so you should have something that looks like this now from here to here should be 13 blocks so count it out 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 that is correct make sure it's 13 because if it's not 13 if there's not 13 blocks between that square and that square you will have to restart trust me guys i remember when i was trying this uh years ago um well it wasn't years ago it's about a year ago i thought i could get away with just doing 12 in between and after I built all the towers up, all the walls, finished all of it, and I was starting on the outside of the walls, I realized you can't get away with it because there's not enough space. So you have to do, absolutely have to do, no less, no more. It has to be 13 blocks wide. All right, so now that you've done that, uh, coming back on the one you just made over here, go on the outside block once again and do it again. So not counting this one, we're going to do 14. So one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen and then fourteen make the symbol or the i keep saying symbol making the same square there we go going to the outside block again 
not counting this one, adding 14. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Same symbol. I'm going to keep saying symbol. Out block, outside block again. Not counting that one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then the 14th one there. So if we go in the sky, you should have a symbol or a big square that looks a little bit something like this. Now this one dirt here is going to get on my nerves. So we're going to get rid of this. There we go. <laughs> um, and there you go. That's what you should have is this right here. Once again, make sure there's 13 blocks between there and there and there and there. If there's not 13 blocks right there, this will not work. You will have to restart. But there you go. That is what we're going to start off with. Now, uh, what you can do now is actually come right here and do this. Because this is where you're going to be able to walk in between actual different towers just like so I'll show you guys when I finish there you go so you should have something that looks like this so basically you just want to leave the middle block opened just like so you guys can pause the video if you need to and once you've done that come in your tower delete the middle block so you can actually walk in between just delete the middle block. Then you have just something that looks like this. Now that you've done this, you want to come over here, well, to all of your towers and build it up some to make like that. Just like so. And you can actually do that on all the other sides as well. Just like so. Come to this one once again. So you've had it like this, add up two. Put a block in the middle, just put two on these. Two up, two up, one in the middle. Two up, two up, or two up, one in the middle. Two up, two up, one in the middle. Two up, all the way around. Coming up on the final one. Two up, oops, my bad, I missed. <laughs> two up, one in the middle. Two up on all of these. And two up, two up, and one in the middle. So you should have something that looks like this. So, so far we've made the outside wall, we've made the inside wall, and we started on the, um, on the, what are the, the towers. So you should, they should be three blocks high total from the bottom, and they should be three high. So what you want to do is add on six more blocks to this. So counting these, so three, four, five, six, wait, my bad, not counting these, so that's, so that's three there. On top of the three, add six. So that's three, four, five, six, with a total of nine. So you can just go one, two, three, four, five, six, or you can either uh, do it again. So these three, so then on top of these three, add another six. So one, two, three, four, five, six, or you can just say three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, counting these three. So you know that'd be like three, four, five, six, seven, eight, did I miss three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Yeah, that's nine. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's easier to me to just go one, two, three, four, five, six, and then. But once you do the first one, you can just you already know it's high enough, and then you can just do this. So you should have something that looks like this. So you want to make sure you have your doorways, and it should be nine total, starting from like I said, from that block up. That's nine tall. I'm gonna do this on all the other ones. So this is three. So four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm gonna, don't think I count that right. So it's, it, it's harder for me to start at four. I think it's easier just to go one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's a lot easier for me to do that. But you know, you guys can do it if you want. There's two ways you can add it up. You just want to do this on all four of the different towers, and we'll be good to go. Now, I'm not going to skip ahead or anything, because, you know, most YouTubers will be like, eh, you guys don't want to watch me do this. We're going to go ahead and skip. I don't want to do that, because I'm going to show you guys every single process and the difference. So that's two, three, four, five, six. That's seven, I think. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, that is. That was seven. You can also do it like this. 
which I think is faster. One, two, three, four, five, six. Look, so once you do the first one, you don't even have to really count. You can just go up. Why, it's so weird. I've got so used to doing that speed now that I don't have speed. I'm going like too fast now. I'm too fast for the game. Let's see, one, two, see, now I'm too slow. Three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now that I then kind of got used to going slow. And you can also do it like this. There we go. So those are all the towers done. Now that you've done the towers, you want to start on the walls. So counting this block, it's going to be five in total. So on top of this, add four. So one, two, three, four. With a total of five. So one, two, three, four with a total of five. So now you just want to do this on all the walls. Just like so. And also on the inner walls as well. So one, two, three, four. Just like that. I do and this is all real time not sped up I definitely suggest using a speed potion as well guys it will help you out in the long run one two three four oops dang one two three four there we go okay I'm telling you I'm sorry guys it's been so long since I've played on the console I'm so used to PC and you know handling this small controller it's so weird and I have on Control Freaks right now, which if you guys know, I usually always use Control Freaks, but I went um, two months without using them. And I recently started using them again yesterday, so it's kind of weird. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, the other way is way faster. So, you know, it's still getting kind of used to it. I'm moving a little bit too much most of the time. One, two, three, four. Boom, there we go. Oh, we got one more to go. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go. There we go. So now what you want to do is you just want to come to the... Now we're done with this. You want to come in the outside here. And not counting this one. So skip over here. You want to put down your cobblestone stairs. You're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Should be like this. Should be able to fit four stairs. In between all of them will be three. Now let me look at my piece of paper here. And let me see, um, what do we do next? Um, it should be this one, I think. Yeah, right here, okay. There's so much just on the piece of paper here. Yeah, but you wanna make sure you can fit all of that in there. Okay, so now that you know you can fit all of that, now what you wanna do is take these away and we wanna get a cobblestone block. Here we go. And where those stairs were is where you wanna put them. So one, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then you want to build all the way up to the final one right here, and then you want to put a stair. So build all, oops, put all the way up, put a stair, all the way up, build a stair, all the way up, build a stair, and then in between, you want to have slabs, just like so. And then. 
Okay, so actually on... Okay, so break away these two and then put it upside down stair. Which makes it look super cool, kind of like it's connected in some way to the actual castle. Okay, so now you're going to put another upside down stair right here, right in the middle of those. Okay, then you're going to go back and take your slabs and on, it should be, yep, so on all of these, add slabs. So it should only be the ones in the, like those three right there. Should be just like that. All right, so now we're gonna need some cobblestone walls. Um, where's cobblestone walls? Oh, it's in this one, isn't it? Yep, cobblestone walls, and then you're also gonna need some iron bars. Now you wanna take your cobblestone walls and. Wait a wait a wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did I get this wrong? Okay, my bad, guys. I'm looking at something. That, okay, get rid of the bot upside down stair right there and make it like this. It should be like this. Okay, I think I actually like saw where we put that upside down stair and I got it confused. My bad. So it should look like. It should look like this. So I'm sorry guys. Just give her the upside down stairs that was right there. And you should have something that looks like this. And then from there you want to add on an iron bar on top. Just like this. This is what we're looking at. This one iron bar and all the sides. So now we're going to copy this onto this side. So we're going to go... One, so it should be just like this, and then we're gonna go all the way up. Let's see if we can do this one without getting it wrong. Stair, 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 stair. Come down right here. Upside down stair, upside, eh. Upside down, upside down, upside down. Wall, 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 wall. Wall wall and then iron bar iron bar iron bar iron bar and then we're gonna have Slab 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 whole bunch of slabs Going all the way across and then have all of them doubled up except the ones in the middle There we go That is how you do it now. Let's do this on all the other sides Put this one here and then skip one two three four do it again one, two, three, four, do it again. Let's get four, there we go. Boom, 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 boom. Upside down, upside down, upside down, upside down. Oops, we hit a block. Wah, 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 wah. Boom, 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 boom. And then slabs all the way across. There's a block right here, I keep hitting. Let's get rid of these real quick. One more side to go. Now, I am playing right now on the uh, PlayStation 4 edition. By the way, this obviously will work on all versions. This is just a building, so you can build this on any version. Beep, 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 and this, 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 this. But the reason that this, we put these, all these slabs and stuff on the side is not to make it look good. That's not where that's supposed to go. But to stop mobs, aka, well mostly, spiders from actually being able to get up here. 
So now spiders will not be able to actually get in your base. It's physically impossible because they can't come up this way, they can't come up this way, and they can't like come up like this way. They just they can't do that. So it's impossible them for, for them to get up here. Alright, so now that we've done that, uh, let's see here. We want to... Okay, so we will actually need those slabs that we destroyed earlier. <laughs> um, where are they? Here they are. So you want to take these slabs and do this. Booyah. Just like this. Let me look ahead. This should be it though for now. I'm trying to like look ahead and see if there's anything else doing with these slabs that I can go ahead and do. Boom. Yeah, so we're actually going to move on to the towers now. So what you're going to want to do is do this. On all of them. Just like this. So we're going to need your iron bars again. So what we're going to do is right here, you're going to mine these two out. And get, these are going to be your windows. Just like this. Like that. There we go. You're going to do this on all four sides. Just the two. Dang it, man. I swear this crosshairs, man. There we go. So funky, man. I can't wait till the Bedrock Edition comes out on uh, PlayStation 4 Edition. So I can play on keyboard and mouse, because I love playing on keyboard and mouse. Except I usually play Minecraft on PC, so I'm used to keyboard and mouse. I don't play on console edition anymore. Like, I didn't even have this game installed until two days ago, and then I reinstalled it, and I did this world. Alright, there we go. That should be all four sides now. Uh, yep. Alright, so now that we've done this, let me see what's next. Oh, wait, actually. Okay, so this is when we actually decide which way is the front. So it's going to be this way. So... So you can actually break away all of this. Just like that. There you go, there's your insurance. All right, so now we're actually gonna start doing the floor. So, get rid of uh, your cobblestone, no, we'll see, we'll get rid of, so we'll get rid of these. All right, so you want to get some oak wood, and you want to get some cobblestone, which we already had, my bad. So, you want to start off um, in the front, should start off, wait, where does it actually start, though? Right here, okay. So starting right here, you want to break this one out, and this is going to be wood facing that way. And you're just going to make the normal, um, like how you would make normal ones. Ooh, I forgot, there is uh, that big thing up under here, so it's going 
be a little bit harder for us to actually do this. Yeah, you just basically want to do this pattern here. Uh, I would suggest continue doing it. Just make sure you don't mess up because it's very easy to mess up these kinds of things. Why is there... See, we already messed up, I think. Because this should go here. See, how did we get so, like... Oh, see, so we, we didn't. It's just... This right here should be that. This right here should be that. And then this right here should be that. And then these, and then these, and then these. Yeah, so we're, we're not messing it up. We just kind of like went kind of crazy there for, for a second. That water is going to get real annoying real quick. But it's already annoying. Just like that, and then we replace all this stone. The cobblestone. I'm just gonna show you guys real quick. Oh my Jesus! I swear, dude, I'm about to like hurt this stupid game, dude. <laughs> I know that doesn't make sense, but this this water is getting annoying. But this is pretty much what you're gonna do. You're just gonna get yeah. Okay, back. So that's pretty much what you're gonna do. You're just gonna keep on doing this. Let's see here. Um, so we need to continue with this. So wood there. As long as you stick with this, I mean, you'll be good. You can't mess up. You just want to be really careful. about uh, where you place down your wood because you can easily mess up very easily because like I don't know how you can mess up so easily you know doing this but like I've made it to where I've done everything but like one block somehow I got messed up like it, it doesn't even like seem possible how it could get messed up, but somehow it got messed up and I had to like restart the whole pattern. Uh, but so yeah, so I've learned over the years to, you know, make sure I get it right the first time because I do not want to restart. I'm actually just going to go ahead and do all the wood first, is what we're doing. See, like this right here, we just messed it up, so now we gotta we need to fix this. We messed up. And see, in quick things like that can mess you up in a heartbeat. Don't try to go ahead and place wood because. I don't care if you're like the smartest person, eventually you will mess up because it's just, it's, well, I don't know, well, I don't, shouldn't say the smartest person. If, if you're that smart, you would know, already know, you know, right? You, you would know that you'd mess up, so you would know not to do it. <laughs> anyway, you know, uh, whatever, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter who you are. I would just, um, the easiest way to do it is just try not to plan ahead. Just go block by block. It's going to get a little boring after a while, you know? But hey, boring is better than uh. Yeah, just think if it was boring before, think about what it would do, what would happen if you messed up. And you had to do the whole thing all over again. Mhm. Mm 
Think how boring that would be and how bad you would feel. Terrible, guys. Trust me. Terrible. Don't want it to happen. Should be the final one. Yep, there we go. We're done. Well, with the main floor, you still have to do all the other ones. Which, trust me, guys, it's a lot easier. So now all you gotta do is delete the stone. And replace it with the cobblestone. Now, I'm really hoping that they, when if they ever do come out with Bedrock Edition, which we know they will, but when they do, I hope, um... I'm hoping well yeah I'm hoping they come out with it but uh when they do it's gonna look a lot better because like see nowadays though a lot of people you know because the new texture pack has changed I don't know if you guys know this but if you don't well, if you just play this version of it you won't know but um since I play on PC I've already played on it because it's already out but um the new default um texture pack you guys may have heard of it if you do keep up with like any kind of Minecraft news um they changed the default texture pack for Minecraft so it's no longer this texture pack it's a new texture pack um and some people thought you know it was going to be like really weird having a new default in it and it wasn't going to be that good but then when it actually got released and people started using it it um and then going back to the old version people said that the new textures are definitely better so this way all you're going to do is like this which is a lot easier than the other way like this. That's why I said it's a lot easier. So it's just wood and then cobblestone, wood, then cobblestone, wood, then cobblestone, then wood, then cobblestone. Yeah, so technically these are not the new default. Or these are not the default. This is not the default texture pack anymore. Um, so I'm hoping that, uh, well, I'm hoping that, like, blah, blah, blah. So, pretty much, like, people nowadays, like, they're making all their builds to, like, make sure they look good in the new textures. You know? So, like, people, even, like, on the older versions, like, for instance, on the Xbox. Um, like, oh, it didn't really work that way because it was already out. But anyway, so pretty much people nowadays are, like, on the older consoles, they're not building, um... You know, like, if you build stuff on the old texture pack, people are not building it to make it look good on the new texture pack. People are building it to make it look good on the new default. Basically, what I'm saying is, like, uh, instead of, you know, like, this may look not the best. You know, this probably doesn't look the best on, I mean, it still looks good, but it doesn't look, look the best on this d texture pack. But I'm saying, when we get the new default texture on console... Um, it's gonna look a lot better, trust me guys, because the new texture pack, the way that everything's 3D, because everything's a lot more 3D, a lot more lifelike, and it's really nice, so when it comes out, and we can see what it looks like, you guys will think, oh wow, this is actually pretty cool, t um, that's not new, actually, I thought that was, that was like, we've never had that before, I said, how much water can be under one house, like, jeez, I didn't build this under a lake, like, I know it seems like I did, but trust me, guys, I didn't. Here, we're just going to do like this. And then if we need to break it, it's already here, though. Boom. Okay, so then we need one here, then here, then here, and then there. And then we can place all of this down. There we go. Oh, my God, even more water. like my eat noises boom there we go that is completely done we are done please be done forever <laughs> okay let's look here what do we got next watch me messed up and it was actually it was supposed to be like stone brick in the floor they are like nope <laughs> all right um so what are we doing now? Uh, 
Okay, so you want to take your cobblestone slabs. So we're gonna we're finishing off the towers now, and you want to put your cobblestone slabs all the way around the outside here, just like so. Which I think we should have done this when we did the other thing. But we are gonna be putting stairs on this as well, so. So just give me a second. Yeah, so we really shouldn't do all of these this way. Yeah, so we're gonna be doing a zone. All of these right here, we're gonna be putting upside down stairs. Just like this. And then up here, you're gonna be putting these down. Yeah, you gotta have your classic tower themed thing right there, right? So once again, put this down there, put that down there. I forgot one right here, didn't I? Yep. And then right here, upside down, upside down, upside down. I forgot one right here too. Upside down, upside down, upside down, upside down, upside down. And then boom, 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 boom. Oh my Jesus. There we go. It's like this. So I, li I like building castles, um, but the thing is they just, they take so much work. That's why I very, very rarely build them. Like this, I think is the only, this is going to be the second castle. No, third castle, my bad. Third castle I've ever built in the years I've been playing Minecraft. And I've been playing a long time. I mean, back when this game first came out on the PS3. Long time. There we go. Alright, now we're done with this. Moving on. Um, okay, grabbing your cobblestone walls. Uh, where are they at? There they are. Coming on the outside block here, just like so. Putting cobblestone walls. Do we do this on the inside part? No, we don't. Okay. So just on the outside. Watching me like uh, mess up my door and I have to like restart. <laughs> well, actually, messing with the door wouldn't do anything. Okay. Now that we've done that, what now? Okay, so we want to find the middle block. And you want to get your cobblestone out. So this is the middle block right here. Come in the back. Build this all the way up. And now you want to grab some furnaces as well. Oh, and you want to do... Why did I get rid of my cobblestone? There we go. This and this. Oh, my bad. And then you actually you want to do... This, this, and then you can do guys and just place these down. Stairs are so tricky. All right, now in between here is where you want to put your furnaces. Obviously, you don't have to put furnaces if you don't want to. Don't we make this whole thing furnaces? Wait, did I get this? Yeah, I knew I was right. Yeah, all of this is actually supposed to be furnaces. Yeah, so just like that. And then to get on the outside around here, you want to get these. Just like so.
Boom. So now you, so now you can walk up here. Oh jeez. Walk up here and then walk around here just like so. Okay, so now you want to come on the corners and line two out all the way up until the last one. And you have to get rid of these two. And then this is not going to be actually fixed, so you actually have to fix this too. Um, and then cobblestone, cobblestone. Just like this. Uh, well, why is it so weird? I didn't mind these two, did I? She made it that just three open like that, right? Two, two, yeah, just like so. And then you want to get some ladders, so we'll get rid of the furnaces. And you want to grab some ladders, ladders, ladders. Here we go. Ladders come in here. Add your ladders going all the way up to the top. Yep, just break right through. Boom, yeah. Just on all the other sides. So, one, two, one, two. Break these, break these. And then we need to put that there. Put this there. And then put some cobblestone, cobblestone. Ladders going up to the top. Once again, over here. One, two, one, two. Break these out, break these, break these, put this, put that there, put that there, put that there, and put that there, and then make this all the way go up. One more, one, two. Once again, this, 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 break that, boom, there we go. And then, under here, with these slabs, oops, that's a block, double up on these, right? Let me look at the picture again. Yeah, so just like this. So, boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. And then also... I'm double checking. Guys, that is it. There you guys go. There is your castle. Now, on mine, I, I did a lot more to my castle. But there's the standard castle. Um, I, I guess I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys did, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe if you're new. Um, now this is just the base castle. If you guys want me to actually see me make this how mine actually was, like I added more windows with like the, the, the stuff, added a little middle area, like a, a tower in the like a big tower in the middle. I had you know like archer towers. I had mine was a lot cooler. So if you guys want to see me actually decorate this thing up, uh, leave a like on the video and subscribe. Let's where's a good angle? There we go. So, yeah, so if you guys want to see me do some more videos on this, like I said, 
Uh, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.